sorry, Misty Ann, still feeling a little under the weather, but never fear. My friends Jamie Beisel and Ann Morrison are filling in for me this week. Uh, Jamie is going to be in Ann's closet, and I am very excited to see what they come up with. Oh, and before I hand it over to Jamie, let me just remind you if this video is at all helpful to you, interesting, entertaining, please give us a like and please subscribe so you never miss another episode of Sunday Night Wardrobe Planning. All right, Jamie, take it away. Miss the Ann's Closet Reaper. She's getting organized, Misty Ann's Closet Reboot, what a sight for your sore eyes. Hi, I'm Jamie Beisel and I'm with Making the Most of What You Have, a personal stylist. And today I'm with Ann Morrison. Say hi, Ann. Hi. And she's going to tell me a little bit about what she needs me for. I know she has some events coming up next week and I'm going to see what I could do to help her. I also want to mention that Anne is recently retired, which means she still has a lot of life left in her, but she has a whole lot more free time to be able to do things that she hasn't been able to do before. So Anne, tell me what it is that you're looking for. So next week I, um, I have a new member coffee with the Kingwood Garden Club. So I've always wanted to be a member of the Kingwood Garden Club, but haven't been able to because they meet during the day and all that sort of stuff. So I went to a meeting and joined the club and they are doing a new member coffee. So, and I noticed at the meeting, everyone was pretty dressed up. So I don't want to go in you know, shorts and a t-shirt because everyone else will be really dressed up. So um, that's the thing I have on Tuesday. I think it's, yeah, Tuesday. And then the following weekend, I'm going to a girl with a girlfriend on a little road trip. like hiking in the daytime in the mornings and then in the afternoon just have a you know clean up and uh, go into Wimberley um, and have lunch and do some you know, shopping and things like that hill country girls getaway weekend okay well I'm definitely gonna be able to help her with her outfits we'll go take a look and see what see what you have so Jamie, this is my closet that I shared with my husband. Um, and you can see it's uh, Oh, you've got a lot more room to go. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, I'm just not using it well. <laughs> um, I guess, and then if you can, because I see where you pretty much have stuff, where do you keep any jewelry or scarves that you might use? Okay. Um, or I belts. Have... Those are all... Um, I got all my jewelry. I have this, um, what is it called? Container store. So I have tons and tons of jewelry because that's what I used to really wear a lot when I was working just to kind of dress up jeans and a t-shirt or black pants and a t-shirt. So I have a lot of jewelry. Um, I've been collecting it over many long years. But now that I'm retired and gardening and cooking a lot, I don't seem to wear my jewelry as much as I used to. And I, and I have like some older jewelry in there, but it's probably not, this is the, my favorite stuff. And then scarves I have in various little storage boxes. I have a few in there. This is a box of scarves, and this is also some scarves. What, I have to see the old jewelry too. Oh really? Yeah, I have to. <laughs> okay. And then this is like really old jewelry, like from the So, I may not want to use it, but I definitely want to check them out. So, in addition to my closet, I also have this armoire where I have a bunch of clothes. Usually, I keep off-season clothes in here and purses I'm not using. So, I have um, I haven't switched to winter yet since it's not really winter weather. But I have um, long sleeve tees. I'm a big tea person, so I have teas in almost every color, but I probably need some new teas because they're getting old. And I have a bunch of uh, cardigans and jeans and cords and things like that.
Christiane's closet reaper, she's getting organized. Christiane's closet reaper, what a sight for your sore eyes. Alrighty, we found Anne her outfit to wear for her garden club. And I want you to know that it took me long and hard to make sure that she had the perfect outfit for her garden club. One of the main things I always like to do is to mix prints. It's always a high-end look and it always means that you really know what you're doing. And this outfit she has on a gray blouse that has a gray and black. I mean, Misty is going to show you what the full outfit looks like on Anne, but I wanted to point out that I did put nude pumps with it. And she has on a pearl necklace and then pearl earrings and a belt. But all the items for the outfit help make it a complete outfit and one that she will get a lot of compliments on. For another outfit for Anne, I wanted to play up the whole athleisure look, which I really like a lot. She's got this cute little skirt and then this blouse that she said she was about to give away. But I like it because it has a collar. And then she wears that under a little Adidas jacket. And with what she has in her wardrobe, we chose these shoes. They fit this outfit best for her. It's not important that the colors don't match. It's important that the whole theme can flow together. Our next outfit is for Anne to show off her good legs, because you have great legs, right? <laughs> Thank you. Um, anyway, this is a pair of cute blue shorts. This is a black shirt that was her son's, but she wanted to wear it and it looked great on her. So she tucks it into her, the shorts. Then she puts this belt that we had with her garden outfit. And then we made some fun jewelry. We layered some necklaces and then some earrings to help bring a little sparkle too that have some red. Another outfit for Anne to wear with her friends is she had this great top in a beautiful plum color and she has this adorable pair of shorts that have like a lace trimmed bottom so we put this and we tucked it in she did not want to tuck in the shirt because she thought she had a stomach but she doesn't have a stomach so we tucked in the shirt and then she wears a scarf from her scarf collection around her waist this is a necklace that we double up on her that makes it the right length for the neckline on the shirt. And she has these awesome gold dangle earrings for her to wear. And you know, Jamie, what I really love about this outfit, it's sort of that, that 70s kind of boho chick look. I really love it and it's so in right now. And I like the idea of wearing my scarves as belts because now that I stopped working, I don't have very many opportunities to wear my scarves. So this is perfect. Ah, oh, that's awesome. I'd like to say that each outfit is my favorite outfit on Anne, but here's another one. Anyway, <laughs> these are some really cute pink shorts. Like I said, they're good for Anne's legs. This is a cotton shirt, and I wanted her to be able to wear the cotton shirt with this. And I loved this scarf. It's too short for a belt, so she is going to wear it as a bow around her ponytail. And then we added both of these necklaces to make it very cute. And then she did have a belt that again helped make the whole outfit perfect. And it just, this scarf has that same pink color as the shorts and it has the white, blue, it just really goes well with this outfit. And I never would have put those together, but when you see them together, it's perfect. For the shoes with that, we, or me, <laughs> chose these clogs again looking through proportions and what worked best with the length of the shorts the shirt the whole theme these were the best shoes and for the next outfit i wanted to try something a little bit different than we'd already been doing i do know that i like her in shorts so i went for a pair of shorts and then i wanted to use some type of a longer sweater this time and this was one of the few she had in her closet and I wanted a blouse to help dress it up. Anyway, so I had her put on all three pieces together. I liked it, and then I wasn't sure about the shoes and if I was gonna wear the sweater open or closed. What I ended up going with was the nude pump. The nude pump elevated it to where it wasn't a casual outfit, that it was actually quite sophisticated. Then on top of that, 
an old belt that she had that even I wasn't sure if we could use. We used the sweater around the sweater. We buttoned a couple of the buttons and then wore it like at your hips hanging down with a chain. And then the outfit still needed a necklace and this necklace helped pull it all together. Here, I'll let you hold these in. The one other thing about the necklace is it was too long still with where it was with their holes. So I told her to go past the clips and she can clip it on the beads with the necklace and it'll make it work. And then for earrings, we just picked out, or Ann picked these out, a pair of cute little gold earrings. Jamie, I had such a great time. Thank you for coming out. You are so talented. I, I think you put together some really great stuff that I never would have thought of. So thank you for driving all the way out to Kingwood to see me. Thank you. Oh, thank you very much. I wanted to ask everybody to please like my Facebook page. It's making the most of what you have. Please go and like it. And please be sure and like Misty's page, Closet Reboot, and her YouTube channel. And we will see you next time. See you next time. Thanks, Closet Reboot. Thanks. <laughs> Make the most of what you have. <laughs> Thanks, lady. <laughs> Thanks Closet Reboot and thanks Make the Most of What You Have. Making the most of what you <laughs> have. Start over.